Welcome back to Love and Junk Food. I'm Laura. I'm John. Today we're doing a US versus UK battle. So what we have today are Heinz Hoops mm -hmm. from the UK. And Campbell's SpaghettiOs from the US. So the cool thing about this is Laura doesn't know which one's which. Mm. It's yeah, that's a the semi thing. blind taste test. Well, first we have to tell you about how they look. Whoa, they're hot. They're <laughs> hot. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay. The funny thing is, I don't know about funny, the pasta is different. Yes. There is a noticeable difference. The sauce is slightly different. This sauce is a little bit more orangey, yep. I would say. Yep. This is more red, red. Yeah, it's a little deeper. The yeah. hoops or spaghettios, the yeah. pasta is thicker and smaller in this one. Yes. Here's what I'll tell you. And it appears there's like different sizes of it, whereas I think yeah, that one... Yeah, more uniform. Uniform, yep. Um, that doesn't help me though, because I think the last time I had SpaghettiOs, I was maybe eight years old. <laughs> yeah. So it's yeah. not like, oh, that's it for sure. Right. I remember it's, it's been too long. I will eat a canned ravioli every once in a while, but I, SpaghettiOs, no, yeah. never, never. I mean, no shade if you like them. I just, I haven't since I was a kid. Yeah, I haven't either. Uh, but... I will, here's the caveat. This is a half blind taste test because since I was the one that poured them in the bowls and heated them up, there is a, a obvious physical difference and I know which one is which. Okay, which one did you use that spoon on? Uh, this one. Both. <laughs> that doesn't help. All right. <laughs> By appearance only, I feel like in my bones, this is SpaghettiOs. Okay. Just by appearance, that, that's a guess. This one feels more familiar. That doesn't mean anything. It was, you know, I'd like to think it was only a couple of years since I was eight, but in reality, it's <laughs> a very, very, very long time. <laughs> okay, cheers. We don't actually cheers. have to do yep. it because <laughs> I don't want that. Okay. Switch. <laughs> so there's a couple of things you need to be thinking about. Well, oh, palate cleanse. Not only which one is, well, you don't need to think about US versus UK, but which one do you like better? Yeah. You know what's sad? No. I like the pasta in this one better. I like the bite, the chew, the yeah. texture of it. Yeah. And the sauce on this one better. Mm, I see. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Don't poison me yet. Don't poison me yet. Let me see. Too late. <laughs> uh, they're very similar. They are. I mean... I just like the pasta so much better. I feel like this is SpaghettiOs. Incorrect. Really? Yep. This is the Heinz there with the uniform pieces and the bigger pasta. And then, yep, this is... Interesting. That. Yeah. So there was something to like. It would be much better for me if it was this pasta and this sauce. This tastes more like what you would actually put on spaghetti to right, me. Right, right. Versus, I don't know. I mean, it's not horrible. That pasta is nice, though. I the pasta's nice. Um, the flavor is... Now that I know, I have to go back. Go ahead, baby. Sweeter. It's the, the Campbell or Campbell SpaghettiOs are sweeter than the Heinz. That's not surprising no. either, right? No. Like no. our baked beans, sweet. UK right. beans, not. And I actually... We don't have to have sugar in every everything, right? right. Yeah. This is UK, right? Yep. 
Yeah, that sauce is... I don't know. <laughs> the... Now that I know, 100% that tastes like childhood. Yeah, yeah. It, it does. It's very nostalgic, you know, it kind of reminds you of childhood. Um, I've never really been a fan of SpaghettiOs, but heck, now that I'm eating them, they're not that bad. <laughs> when I was a kid, I didn't like them, but they're not that bad now. Um, I do like the sauce on the Heinz. I agree with you. That's, that's pretty good. What about the pasta? Um, well, I better try it again. In the States, we have SpaghettiOs, we have SpaghettiOs with... Also, wait, wait, wait. Somebody who knows more than I do, Janice is always good for looking things up. <laughs> I didn't think of this before. But in my bones, I feel like SpaghettiOs were made by Franco-American. Oh yeah, right, yeah. When did it become Campbell's? It must have been did bought Campbell's out or something. Buy Franco right? Don't they you remember have. commercials like you're homesick and so you watch all the the, the commercials yeah. and game shows and whatever. It was Franco-American, always. Yeah. But anyway, um, we have SpaghettiOs like this, obviously. Um, SpaghettiOs with little hot dog pieces oh, yeah. cut up. We have the ravioli. We have beefaroni, which is kind of like the long little, like what you find in mac and cheese or Kraft Dinner. Um, those kind of little straight noodles with like um, a sauce like this with a little bit of beef. And then what am I missing? Um, the ravioli I said. Oh, and can't you get just like spaghetti in a can? I too? think so. Yeah, I think so. So let us know if you're in the UK. I'm so curious if they have all the different varieties as well. SpaghettiOs was never my favorite. My favorite was always ravioli. This is all right. Yeah, it's good. Uh, which one do you prefer? I want to wash off these noodles <laughs> and throw them in to this sauce. Um, I prefer this one. You do? I mean, this one feels like childhood to me, but now yeah. I know why kids like it so much, right? It tastes like sugar, kind of. I mean, really, mm. tomatoes are sweet by nature, but then if you add a bunch of sugar to it, it I mean, this is just super sweet it's, compared to this one. Well, I don't think it's super sweet. It is sweeter, but I don't think it's like overpoweringly sweet. But you no, know, but it's it sweet sweeter. compared to this oh, one. Oh, for sure. Um, I prefer the Campbell's. You do? Yeah, and it's not just for the nostalgic. I, I don't know. I like it. I like the pasta a lot better. It's just thicker and more toothsome, I guess. Yeah. Mm. I no. like the different sizes of it, too. Mm -hmm. I don't mind. I don't mind that one. So, I mean, this isn't my new favorite go-to lunch. <laughs> Either of them, to tell you the truth. Yeah. But anyway, uh, we found ours. At, where did we find it? Was it at Jungle Gyms or was it? So here's the thing. <laughs> we actually purchased a can of this previously, I think at the World Market, and we still have it. So we still have our Heinz hoops. Mm. Um, but then when we were at Jungle Gyms, we got another can. So, okay, there yeah. you have it. Yeah, I, you know, during that time, we had all of our stuff set up in the studio, and then you probably saw, if you're on the vlog channel, that we started making a studio, and then life took a turn. We started directing our time towards, you know, in a different area, so we need to go back. We need to get the studio finished. We're going to start filming from there soon, but that's where several of our things are for, yeah. for recording, so anyway. Making a mess. <laughs> Let us know the different <laughs> varieties in the UK and which one you prefer if you like this stuff. In general, I wouldn't say let's run out and start having SpaghettiOs from now on. Right. Oh, well, yeah. No. Um, do we want to talk about anything that's on here? So, um, two ninety calories okay. in the can. Okay. Let's see. For half a can, it says one hundred and five k cals. Okay. Or 443 kJ, which I'm not sure if that means kilojoules or what. Yeah, maybe <laughs> I don't we, know what I mean. maybe we can't compare very easily yeah. because, you know, we use different things. Yeah. Carbs in one cup is 33 grams. That's a lot of carbs in a half a can of SpaghettiOs. That's, you Yeah, know. carbs uh, here are 21.1 grams. Okay. So... 
I'm looking on here to try to, there's some skim milk, I'm trying to look for things that I recognize, right? Water is the main ingredient, which that's surprising to me. Okay. Followed by tomato puree. Um, and then enriched pasta made with wheat flour. And then we get into a bunch of stuff that I can't pronounce or <laughs> read well, this time. Well, here's the thing. I think this is, uh, uh, the hoops are a little more, I don't know, maybe healthier. They don't have all those work, you know, all the phosphates. Not and maybe stuff like healthier, that. but more natural for sure. Right. Yeah. Um, so it's got water, durum, wheat, semolina, tomatoes, more water, sugar, modified corn flour, salt, acid, which is citric acid, mm -hmm. spice, garlic, salt, onion extract. So, all right, um, fun. We love, we love our snacks. Don't get us wrong, but we thought it would be fun to try something that's more like shelf stable lunch, dinner kind of stuff. Yeah. And it's hard to find things that we can compare you know, apples to apples, because right. a lot of the things that you have in the UK, we don't have here and vice versa. So when we saw these, we were like, oh my gosh, we have to do that comparison. If you can think of anything else, if there's a cereal, if there's a soda, if there's a biscuit or a cookie or something else that you think we have something just like it here and we can compare, same, same, let us know in the comments. We would love to give it a try. Yes. Come find us on social media if you haven't already. Uh, we are most active on Instagram. Check out our stories. We post there pretty frequently. Um, come find us on our new channel where we vlog and travel a little bit and do some stuff outside of this house, outside of eating food, as well as our game channel. We yes. love to sit in the evenings and play games with one another when we, we have the do. time to do that. So right. come find us over there. Links to all of the channels are down in the comments of this video. Now, if you love all things UK, like we do, we, it's not just the UK. Right. We love trying foods from all over the place. All of a sudden we're getting lots of comments on our videos from New Zealand. Yeah. And um, I think we're gonna be getting a box from there and that is super exciting. That is. We have a couple things to try from Germany. We have some Asian snacks. Um, we love to try things from the Philippines and you're gonna be seeing lots more international stuff on our channel always. That's our favorite thing we do on our channel. Right. So if you love traveling the world through food with us or SpaghettiOs, let us know if you're a fan. Um, yep, or Heinz Hoops. Or Heinz Hoops. Or us, or the video. Yeah. Give this video a big thumbs up. It really does help us when you do that. That's all we have for today. That's it, guys. See you next time. Bye.